Now, whether you call them coyotes or coyotes, the wild animals are rampant here in Edmonton. And now some here in the northwest neighborhoods of Sherbrooke and Dovecourt believe coyotes are behind a rash of cat killings. Now, one man is sharing security video with City News. The disturbing images he hopes will warn others to keep their pets safe. On this quiet street, it's not uncommon to see cats roaming free. But Tuesday morning, I was just, my heart just sunk. Basil Yasishin found, found a dead cat. Like my uh, video cameras, because I thought, who would leave a cat laying on the side of the road? And it looked like it had been shot, so I was kind of concerned. But the video showed the cat running from a coyote, trying to climb a tree, but unable to, before being plucked by the animal. You know, and then I tried to get up on this side. It got to about here, began to slide. But, but then he noticed the cat had been declawed. If it had claws, it might have had a chance and got away from the, the coyote because it would have been able to climb up the tree. But unfortunately, you know, no claws, no chance. Declawing cats was recently banned by veterinarians in Alberta. So that's a really horrible thing. And this is a prime example why for the co-founder of Holistic Veterinary on White. He caught cat. I mean, that's really... That's like letting a blind cat outside. That's not fair. Overwhelmingly, the veterinarians of Alberta came out against declawing, uh, tail docking, and ear cropping. Declawing is the worst. It's not a claw, it's a whole digit. Now, the city estimates we have around 2,000 urban coyotes, and this park ranger says they are important for managing our rabbit population. But still, instances like this are a reminder to pet owners of the dangers of leaving them out unattended. Especially at night, because human traffic, there's a lot less of that at night, so the coyotes are more free to roam from the green spaces, finding those unfortunate food sources. In this attack, the cat was killed, but not eaten eaten, which biologists say is not uncommon, as it could be hunting practice. Anybody who has declawed cats, don't let them outside, especially this time of year, because the, the coyotes are, that's what they're doing. They're hunting and they're practicing their hunting. From Northwest Edmonton, Carly Robinson, City News.